Lewis, obviously not the result we were looking for today. How do you sum up today's game? Um, you know, I've got to be honest. It's been a it's been a long sort of 24-hour period um, for the for the boys and and and, and the staff, and obviously for the gaffer. Um, but you know, it's one of those that crazy. I'm going to say it, but after a 2-0 loss, but I stand here with, with just pride in in the group, like sort of sticking together and. and and going out and you know trying their, trying their best, you know, and, that, and that's all and that's all we ask. Um, disappointing to the run to come to an end. You know, we felt like we've been really sort of been really decent over the last few games. Um, but you know, like I said, the, the ultimate thing is just just big pride. I suppose the amazing thing about the group we have is you can just never fall the effort levels. No, definitely not. No, you just got to look at the end there with ten men, and we've still got the quality and the composure at times to play and trying to get the ball down, and, and we're still creating a couple chances. I think Rem's gone really close with a header from a corner, so that just shows that the, the character in the group. Um, but like I said, I can't fault any of them for for the, their work rate, the, the, the way they prepare for games, the, 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 just them, just them as men. So that. I, I'll echo it again, just just pride in them and fair play to them. How much of an impact do you think going down to 10 men had? Did, did you see a way back into the game when we were 1-0 down? Um, I don't, nah, listen, you've got to give credit to Mansfield. I thought they were really good on the day and I thought they they were much the better team for, for long periods. Um, but, you know, I think we've got to have a little bit more a bit more a little bit more belief in, in ourselves and I said that to the boys inside we've been on a fantastic run for the last six games five wins out of six that, that, that doesn't just happen by chance um, but you know it's only one loss it's, it's, it's only one loss uh, and I've got to say they, they, were, they were very good on the day Mansfield and they, they really uh, put us under pressure in, in areas that you know we haven't we haven't had for, for a while so you know Fair play to them, and obviously they're going great guns, and they're, they're, they're right up in that sort of lottery, lottery of the in the playoffs, and, and that's where we want to strive to be. And uh, it just shows how far we've come as a club and as a group that we're coming to a Mansfield away, and we're disappointed not to come away with something. And just how good was Glenn Morris today? Yeah, listen, I, I, I don't want to just pick out Cat like, like I say. Like I'm, I'm, I'm proud of them all, all of them, but. That's every day, and it's not just the players, the staff as well, the, the unsung heroes that you know they, that, 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 that go behind and do sort of the jobs that not everyone sees to help prepare the team. I've got, I've got to thank them as well. And obviously, looking forward now, it's five wins and seven. It's still positive stuff towards the end of the season. Hundred percent, hundred percent, and that's what I say. Like, it's disappointing that that little mini run of, I think it's three on a bounce has come to an end. But that doesn't mean we don't try and go the last three three on the bounce like, and, and that's what everyone strives to, to win every game and listen they've they've done a job on us and they've played, they've, they've played very well but that doesn't mean that we don't dust ourselves down and, and, and then just go and what is a local derby on Tuesday and be ready to go go and play that How excited are the lads heading into that Sutton game? Listen the players just love playing football not so much training but they love they just love playing football and being out there is, is, the, is, the, is their love and they're already thinking about that next game and a little bit, a little tinge of disappointment because of how the results went around us today. But we're one point away from last season. We've got to take massive pride in that. And that's, what, that's where it stems from. But um, like I said to them in there, season's not over yet. We've still got three games to go and we're still building. Lewis, 93 travelling supporters today. Just incredible support as always. They've been fantastic all season. And, and that's where I say like, that they, they won't let us as a group uh, stop. And we will forever, forever be indebted to the, their support and the, the, the way they travel with. And always, always to the very end, they were there with us right at the very end. Uh, and you can see in the players that we, we go over and uh, we, we appreciate it. And hopefully, we can get loads to come on Tuesday and make it a real, real good atmosphere uh, at Sutton because it, it is a local derby. And hopefully, we can put some smiles on the, on our, our away fans as it is only down the road. So hopefully, we can get a few. Lewis, thank you.